Good morning, my loves. I trust everyone's had a great week. Today's project is of this maxi skirt that I've had for a while and to be honest, didn't quite know where I was headed with this project. That I transformed to this sexy dress that I would wear to a date. So if you'd like to see how I achieved this, then just keep watching. I started by laying the skirt down and then doing the zip and removing the waistband. Next, I opened it up and separated the two front and back pieces. This fabric had stretch on one side only and I folded it along the stretch and traced the pattern with one of my favorite pencil dresses, leaving enough allowance in case I'll need to adjust it and because the stretch wasn't as much as the dress I used to, to trace on it. I honestly had no idea where to head with this and was a little lost with this top design but just went for it. This happens sometimes. Next, I trace this on the back piece with the wrong side up and cut it out, leaving the top backs open. I then cut it in half and did two darts on each side of the front dress piece like so. Next I hemmed the top of the two back pieces and proceeded to hem the middle sections as well. I then installed an invisible zip off camera like so, then proceeded to stitch the front and back pieces together, then tried it on and adjusted the sides accordingly. I then took this beautiful lace fabric that I had from a previous project and traced 15 inches down then traced it up with the dress. Next I proceeded to stitch this to both front and back pieces and did the hemming then stitch down the sides.
this lace had more than enough stretch so I didn't need to have a slit at the back. I took the remaining less strips and joined them together to get two long strips. I did long running stitches and made gathers to each then pinned them to the sides of the front bodies. I then stitch this down. Note here is I place the right side of the lace against the wrong side of the body so that when the lace is flipped, the right side stays up on the right side of the bodies. I hope that made sense. I then folded the top section about half an inch then stitched it down then folded it again and stitched along the edge leaving a loop for a drawstring. I then proceeded to cut a strip and drew it through the loop with a safety pin and with that I was all done. This is the final look and to be honest I wish I made the top dress section a little longer so I could wear this to a day event but I'm still okay having to wear it on a special date night so you guys can let me know your thoughts on the same and if this is something that you guys love. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and feel free to share this and the rest of the videos with your friends. Until the next project I wish you all an amazing weekend ahead. Bye loves!